Hello everyone, it is Miss Veronica with Growing Brilliant and we are here to do a circle time. Let's start off by singing hello. Hello my preschool friends, how are you? Hello my preschool friends, how are you? It is time to start our day, we are here to work and play. Hello my preschool friends, how are you? We are here and we are going to do our Where Is song. Under our flowers today, we have something that is yellow. It is a bird and it says the sound quack, quack. Do you know what we're looking for? We are looking for a duck. And to sign duck, you're going to take your fingers by your mouth and open and close them just like this, duck. Let's go over our flowers and see what colors we have. Our first flower is a blue flower. You're going to take your thumb over your palm and wave it like this. Blue flower. Our next flower is a purple flower. You're going to take three fingers, take your thumb in between two, turn it upside down, and shake it just like that. Purple flower. And our last flower is a red flower. So you will say red flower. Let's get started with our blue flower and see where our duck is. Here we go. Where is duck? Where is duck? Here I am. Here I am. Hiding under blue flower. Hiding under blue flower. Look and see. Look and see. Okay, everyone, let's quack to three and see if our duck is under our blue flower. Are you ready? Say quack, 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 peek-a boo Oh, our duck's not there. Where do you think our duck is? Hmm, let's look under our purple flower and see if he's there. Let's go. Where is duck? Where is duck? Here I am. Here I am. Hiding under purple flower. Hiding under purple flower. Look and see. Look and see. Okay, let's quack to three again and see if our duck is under our purple flower. Here we go. Quack, quack, quack. Pika. Boom! Our duck's still not there. Maybe he's under our red flower. Let's work together so that we can look under our red flower next. Let's go. Where is duck? Where is duck? Here I am. Here I am. Hiding under red flower. Hiding under red flower. Look and see. Look and see. Okay, let's quack pretty loud this time and see if our duck is under there. Are you ready? Let's say quack, quack, quack! Pika! Look at that! We found our duck. Do you see our duck? And he is yellow. He has a beak. And look at his little feet. Thank you so much for finding the duck with me. We are going to talk some more about ducks and sing some songs. We are going to talk about ducks. Ducks are creatures that like to migrate. Migrate means that they move from one place to another. They change their habitat and a habitat is an animal's home. So they move from their home to another home for different reasons. Sometimes it's to find food and different shelter or because the climate changes. That means the weather changes. So ducks move to find different habitats and because the weather changes. So we are going to sing a song, but first let's count the little ducks that I have. The song is called Five Little Ducks. So let's see how many ducks we have here. One, two, three, four, five. We have five ducks. And when you take one duck away, you have how many? Let's count. One, two, three, 
four. You take one duck away from five, you have four. Let's take one more away and see. If you take one more away, we have one, two, three, three ducks. When there were four ducks and we took away one, now there are three ducks. Let's take another one away. One, two, now there are two ducks. We had three ducks and we took one away and now we have two. Let's take another one away. One, we have one duck. We had two ducks and we took one away and now we have one. Let's take our last duck away. And how many ducks do we have? Zero, we have no more ducks. Let's add our ducks back. To one, two, three, four, and five. Five ducks. Let's go ahead and sing our song. Five little ducks went out to play over the hills and far away. Mama Duck said, quack, 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 but only four little ducks came back. <gasps> only four ducks? One, two, three, four. We only have four, we don't have five anymore. Four little ducks went out to play over the hills and far away. Mama Duck said, quack, 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 but only three little ducks came back. <gasps> only three little ducks came back. One, two, three. Three little ducks went out to play over the hill and far away. Mama Duck said, quack, 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 quack. But only two little ducks came back. <gasps> two little ducks. One, two, only two. Two little ducks went out to play over the hills and far away. Mama Duck said, what did she say? Quack, quack, quack. And only one little duck came back. Only one. One little duck went out to play over the hill and far away. Mama Duck said, what'd she say? Quack, quack, quack. And no little ducks came back. Hmm, all the ducks are gone. Hmm. Sad Mama Duck went out one day over the hills and far away. <laughs> Sad Mama Duck said, what did she say? She said, what did she say? She said, quack, quack, quack. And all five little ducks came running back. Look, all the ducks came back to Mama Duck. Let's count them. This one's falling over. Ready? Say one, two, three, four, Five. Five little ducks came back for Mama to play with Mama. Thank you for singing that song with me. We're going to read a story. Are you ready? We're going to read a story and it is called Wiggle Waggle by Jonathan London. We are going to read this story, and in this story, you will see that there are lots of movements that it tells you about, movements that different animals do. So after we read the story, together, we are going to go outside, and we are going to do the movements. So let's read the story first. It is called Wiggle Waggle. <laughs> Many animals walk, and so do you. Some walk funny, and some hop like a bunny. Now this is your chance to do an animal dance. See what the first animal is. How does a duck walk? 
wiggle, waggle, wiggle, waggle. A duck. Let's see what the next animal is. How does a horse walk? Clippity clap, clippity clap. How does an elephant walk? Clump, clump, clump. How does a camel walk? Gomp, gomp, gomp. How does a penguin walk? Wibble waddle, wibble waddle, wibble waddle. How does a pig walk? Snuffle root, snuffle root. <laughs> How does a frog walk? Flop, flop, flop. How does a bear walk? Bumble roll, bumble roll. How does a cat walk? Pish, posh, pish, posh. How does a kangaroo walk? Boing, boing, boing. Now add it all together. Let's wiggle a feather. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle goes the duck. Clippity clop, clippity clop goes the horse. Clump, clump, clump goes the elephant. Gollum, gollum, gollum goes the camel. Wibble, wobble, wibble, wobble goes the penguin. Snuffle root, snuffle root goes the pig. Flap, flap, flap goes the frog. Bumble roll, bumble roll goes the bear. Pish posh, pish posh goes the cat. Boing, boing, boing goes the kangaroo. And now we're through. What about you? The end. So we are going to go and practice some of those animal moves. Meet me outside. So we are going to do a few of the moves that the book shows us. Let's look at the ones that we are going to do. We are going to wiggle waggle like a duck because we've been talking about a duck. We're going to clippity clop like a horse. We are going to clump like an elephant. And for our last one, let me find it. We are going to wibble wabble like a penguin. So let's do those moves together. Wiggle waggle like a duck. So let's see how we can wiggle waggle like a duck. I think what we could do is get on our knees just like this. Bend your knees and can you move your feet back and forth like this? And that's wiggle waggling like a duck. Let's do that again. You're going to bend your knees and you're going to move just like this. That's how you can wiggle waggle like a duck. Let's look at our next animal again. We are going to clippity clop like a horse. Here we go. So I think we should go like this. Clippity clop. Just like we're skipping a little bit. Can you clippity clop like a horse? Very good. See what our next animal is. The elephant. We're going to clump, clump, clump. So get your feet and clump really big. Clump, 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 clump. Very good. And our last animal was the penguin. Wibble wobble. So you're gonna put your arms down by your side, very straight, stand up straight, and you're gonna point your hands out and wibble wobble like a penguin. Can you do that? Can you wibble wobble like a penguin? Very good, thank you for doing those animal moves with me. I want you to practice those moves that, that I just showed you at home. 
make some space with your somewhere that you can move your arms and move your feet and practice those moves. I had fun going outside with you and showing you some moves that you can do at home to exercise. I hope you and your parents can use these moves and act like animals and have a lot of fun. Let's wave and sing goodbye. Everybody wave and sing goodbye. Everybody wave and sing goodbye. Everybody wave and sing goodbye. Sing goodbye, goodbye. Bye-bye.